down in the hood. <laughs> so far down, they ra wrap their gas meters and barbed wire. Because you ain't stealing my gas, motherfucker. <laughs> That guy is f literally fucking on coke or something. He cracked out. Oh, here's a deal breaker. <laughs> and my partner's gonna order the white, yep. And I, I don't think he has yet. Well, let's drop you guys. Alright, welcome back to FBK Racing. Different video for you tonight. Um, so yesterday we went because. Let me start this over. We went because. <laughs> all right, all right. Take two. I'm gonna put that first part in here. So, welcome back to FBK Racing. Different style video today. We are going to find Dad a new truck. His 05 Suburban has seen better days, and with the amount of towing that we do, and he's always borrowing my truck. This, that, and the other thing. It's time for him to have a truck. So, yesterday we went and looked. Where the hell were we? Poughkeepsie. Poughkeepsie, New York. Went and looked at a truck that uh, that was at a dealership called Slim Shady's, Shady Auto Sales. Truck was not as pictured. Every body panel on it was damaged, blah, blah, blah. So today, we're on our way down to the longest island, Long Island, New York, to hopefully find a new truck. It's a 15 Duramax. It is a Sierra SLT. Has a sunroof, mine does not. Sun drop roof. down DVD. Drop down DVD player. For the little kids. For the little munchkins back there. Say hi. Hi. So. And if I want to stop on the side of the road on a nighttime road trip and watch a bear here. I'm an old guy. I yeah. might get lonely on a road trip. Can't believe you just said that. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> we're gonna make our way down to uh the New York City part that everybody just thinks of when you hear New York. So hey, we're gonna make our first trip on the LIE. LIE. LIE, Long Island Expressway. So apparently I gotta drive hard. Hard. And fast. Two hands. Hard and fast. That's how I like it. <laughs> Never mind. Alright, we're going on a road trip. A little update. The engine for the drag racing ranger is three quarters of the way back to actually more than that, like seven eighths of the way back together. Just gotta put the rear cover on it, flex plate, and uh, that's basically it for that. Fuel rails. Oh, we gotta do the fuel rails and stuff. Put the intake on, but I think I'm gonna leave all that stuff off until we get the engine set down in the ranger. But we're making progress with that. Um, the Danger Ranger Ranger. Ranger, 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 Ranger. It's getting a new cage. So I ordered 80 feet, uh, inch and a half. I just got EWS, electronically welded steel. Because I don't value my life, apparently. But no, because it was cheaper, and it is what it is, and I don't plan on wrecking. So, anyway, main hoop, uh, halo, bars go down through the dash. Actually, I think we're going to take the dash out. I think it's part of the rules. You can. Uh, dash bar. Then we're going to do three kidney bars on the left side. And for some reason, per the rules, they want two on the right side. I don't know if they mean at the right side door or on the right side of me. But no. So, we'll find out more on the rules on that and uh, we'll, we'll cover that in another video. Um, but I think the next video you guys will see will be uh, me putting the motor together for the Ranger because I, I did a lot of uh, video and joking around for that so that's that stay tuned for the rest of the video and follow along on our trip to to L E W no no L I it's the L I E whatever <laughs> to Long Island city in uh, bumper to bumper traffic and 
There's K's. And I might leave him here. It's not, it's not my fault. It is his fault. No. He did not check his phone. And the guy messaged him at 11.51, told him that someone put a deposit on the truck. He has not communicated with the guy one time our whole trip down here. I talked to him. I called him on the phone, said we're coming down. He said, okay. So anyway, He sent me his address, and we left. So After anyways. The conversation. But then, people know this. You just... I don't do that. I called the guy. We're on do. our way. He gave me his address. No, you gotta keep people. You gotta keep them real. You gotta keep them reeling them in yeah. the whole time. Reeling them in. He was in Boston. He'd be home in two hours. So, anyway, somebody put a deposit on the truck. You probably can't see me now, but somebody put a deposit on the truck, and now it's not for sale. But if we would like to come and look at it, we can. So we're going there with X amount of dollars, cash in hand, and we're taking the goddamn truck. I think. I hope. But anyways. We're on our way. We're in a tunnel. Or we just set ourselves up to get robbed. Or we're getting robbed. We told them we're coming with a boatload of cash. Right. Just gotta be a, just gotta, oh my god, just gotta be a kid sometimes. And welcome back to the last day at FBK Racing. Good. fired. Good. I'll quit. Have to be an idiot under bridges. Casey, okay, so window down. It's nice out. You say hi? Hello. So, yeah, we just got off the phone with the guy and he said we can come look at it if we want to, but he can't sell it to us because somebody already put a $4 deposit on the thing. We're going there with $25,000 cash and apparently that means nothing in today's world. So, now we're just going to drive around New York City, maybe get a hot dog or something. <laughs> I don't know. Well, if you look in front of us, that's New York City. That's where we're heading. I figured uh, I was going to leave him at Times Square. Actually, we decided just to go to Times Square and instead of wasting this trip, uh, we'll show the kids New York City. You want to go to New York City? Yeah. Maybe even take them to the Disney store. Get them a prize. I, I wish we could go to the M&M store. Oh, they, oh, now they want to go to the M&M store. You oh. No. Giz. Gregor. Yeah. We're in New York City. I'm just trying to blend in. Oh, Alright guys, when you're in New York City. Gotta get dirty water hot dogs. Dirty dog. water hot dogs, gotta have them. What'd you guys get? Just drinks? Oh, yeah. You wanna buy you my hot dog? No. Gregor? No. What are we doing? We're going up the escalator. The escalator? Where are we? We gotta go to the floor of three because Bamba's gonna pee. Guys, the saga continues this time. We're not taking my truck. We're not putting all the miles on my truck. We're taking the old 5.3 slob, baby. Take a mom's whip. This is basically a race car. Hey, where are we going? I'm not even gonna get into it. <laughs> I'll get in. This is number five. Get it? I'll get in. Yeah, this is number five. We're gonna get vehicle five. Oh, wait, the key don't no, go. No, the key don't go. There the key goes, goes here. here. Right there. And he's driving. Woo! I don't know why I'm sitting on the dash. Other than my mother's two feet tall. Right, that's enough gas for now, right? We can get the hell out of yeah. here. Yeah. Or do you want to go and top off it? No, nope. get the hell out of Dodge.
dad just waking up from his little cat nap. Nappers. Nappers. Yep. It's not a cat nap. It's making my back feel better. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, fat back. Don't get fat. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyways, ah. we're about a mile out, and uh, we're gonna tentatively go buy a truck again. So, uh, bear with us, and we'll see if this is a deal. All right, found the truck. Looks good. All right. Ready? Buy it. All right, buy it. Yeah. Just throw the money at the guy and let's go. Until we find out it's got a major oil leak. Yeah. Transmission fault. Transmission, it's deleted already. I mean, um, yeah, so it's already been beaten on. And nothing more than I wouldn't put it through, so. You can guarantee you his foot isn't as heavy as mine. What the hell's going on? This guy's still learning how to loop a swoop and pull. <laughs> All right, we bought it. No, I'm just kidding. We're on Not test drive. We're on test drive. Um, he did take the good tires that were on it off of it and put some square thumpers like, thumpers on it. It's gonna be a two and a half. If we make the deal, two and a half hour ride home. Yeah. So um, he took some. He's gonna take some money off the price. It has a three position tune in it. It's taped up underneath the dash on position one, which is thirty horse. So far, seems seems decent. Everything works in here. Mine, oh, my heat seat's working. My bottom's not working. I think. I don't know. I can't tell. No, maybe it's not working. But anyways, seems uh seems all right. That's the whole reason I wanted it. Hey, we own a repair shop. We can fix stuff like that. Yeah, but I'd like to buy it already working. They're thirty-five thousand dollars, and they come with working heated seats. I do like it's got brown interior and cocoa four liners. It's pretty, uh, pretty fancy. Straight pipe, it's not that loud, not as loud as mine. I wonder if it's because the tailpipe is two more feet longer. So. What's that noise? Is that rear end? Uh, it sounds like tires, hard to tell. No, that's tires. 100% like tires. Yep. Yeah. Exhaust so brake works. Not the rear end? That's why you changed the tires so we couldn't hear the rear end. Maybe, maybe you're reaching. Maybe. Never know. Maybe I'm 57 and I've been around the block a long time. So. Mm -hmm. We're gonna keep driving. Yeah. Alright, she's a nice unit. She's a nice unit. Got a little, uh, couple chips right here. That we can't have touched up. That's gonna crawl underneath and check it for leaks and stuff. It's got a little bit of a rear end noise. We didn't confirm that. Uh, tailgate's got a dent in it. That's not a big deal. Uh, got a dent in the bumper again, not a big deal. No lights on for parking sensors. It's a fair with the wind here. There's no rot in there. It's just starting to go in there. So we'll uh, have the uh, body shop clean that up inside there and paint it back up. Probably have a paint this fender up here. Which is not a deal breaker. He's picking this thing apart like, like everything. Texas truck, he said. I don't know if that's true or not. But it's not rusty, I can tell you that. It's not that rust. This is just surface rust out here. But she's decent. Got all the 
old stuff in the back. Does it have lights? Nope, does not have a light. Mine's got a light in here. But. Slow open tailgate still works. Here we go. All in all, not a bad truck. So uh, all I gotta do is convince him that it's not a bad deal. The guy's not screwing him. Maybe we'll buy a truck. Or maybe I'll buy the truck and sell my truck. Sell dad my truck for $45,000. i will take this one. Dial it up. Because it's my green truck. Four door, eight foot man. White. That's all I like. Definitely need some uh, chrome 22s on there. Needs rear brakes. calipers too because every every GM of this vintage with those calipers on the back they're yeah. all junk I can say this is the most time we've spent with a truck got a lot of dirt under the frame he said he owned property so up in Vermont so, we'll uh, catch back Within the last like four or five months, it was deleted. Actually, it was you're on YouTube now. You're gonna oh, be good. Yeah, <laughs> this is Austin. Yeah, he just now. he just sold us this awesome, this. awesome truck. And uh, that's dad. He's finally happy now. He's got a Duramax, and now I don't have to put miles on my truck. I can ride around with you. Passenger side. Hey, now I can nap in the passenger seat. No, I think I'm gonna leave this in the driveway and keep this drive the suburban. In the <laughs> that's what I'm gonna do. To have this thing undercoated, make it really, really like pristine. Get some chrome 22s for it. What's on 18s or 20s? 18s. Good news. I guess I said he used tires back at the shop to fit this. So again, thank you, sir. Appreciate it. We're gonna go to Hooters now. Thank you. Thanks for deal. Are you prepared? Huh? Are you prepared? To go broke on your first fill up? I'm gonna say, what's in this quarter of a tank? Yeah, I gotta see which credit card I can use. Diesel prices are, where are we? 469. We're gonna say 150. You'll never guess where we are. We're at the Hooters. Look at him, hard parking that unit. <laughs> Things a country mile long, four door. Eight foot bed. Tell us about your Hooters experience. Uh, actually, I didn't really care for the wings. Uh, I had 15 wings and I nope. ate them all. Didn't care for them. Yeah, he ate everything that was even around here. Uh, he had one left over. I ate it. He had the mozzarella stick. I ate it. Might even finish his water. I did have a. Uh, Tall boy. So, you're seeing this. I'm gonna be drinking and driving, dudes. So are you in your new truck on a what? dealer plate? You're gonna be drinking and driving, dealer plate. Yeah, drinking water. Uh -huh. It's empty. <laughs> <laughs> that was from the last person that was here. Yeah, they just brought me a glass. <laughs> I can sniff it. So, we're gonna make our way back home. On the medical way back home. I stole three wet naps, so that's pretty exciting. And that's about it. Finally got out of the truck. We'll recap in the morning. With it's daylight. Peace out. We gotta turn this off and don't wanna get copyrighted. So, <laughs> we're flipping through dad's phone. Austin, if you're watching this, these are some pretty sick sunglasses, dude. I didn't know this was your style, but I'm digging them. So I'm gonna end it off here. Man, no, I'll probably end it off tomorrow, but later, dudes.